hey y'all so if you want to know how to get this look this is my everyday makeup look just about everyday makeup look i don't know but if you want to know how to get this look just stay tuned and keep on watching keep watching hey all right so i already did my eyebrows and primed my face but i'm just gonna put on some lip balm so my lips aren't dry then I'm going to start off by priming my eyelids. I use the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Priming Potion when I tell you this is the GOAT. Alright, this is the GOAT, y'all. So my eye look is going to be real simple. I just want to add a little bit of dimension and color. I'm going to use the color Chestnut in my crease for my Mally Nude Attitude Palette. And then using my Too Faced um, Peanut Butter and Jelly Palette, I used the color Peanut Butter on my lid just to blend everything out so it's not too harsh. Y'all know this is my favorite foundation, but this is my NARS Luminous Weightless Foundation. Um, I'm not sure what color I am in this, but yeah. Alright, so using my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Fawn, I'm just going to put this underneath my eyes to conceal and highlight and all of that good stuff. Um, yeah, I'm blending out with my fingers because I find that when I use a beauty blender for my highlight, it picks up a lot of the product. So I blend it out with my fingers first, and then I go in with the beauty blender at the end. But make sure y'all wash your hands. Like, don't be putting your dirty hands in your face because y'all going to break out, and that's never cute. Alright, so I'm not going to be baking today, but I am going to set right underneath my eyes because I do have a creasing problem. But yeah, to set, I'm going to use my Airspun Translucent Setting Powder. I got it from HEB, I think, for about 3 or $4. But I love it though, it doesn't give me any flashbacks, so yeah, y'all should try that out. For my contour today, I'm using my Black Radiance Highlight and Contour Duo. I'm not sure what color I have, I think it's the darkest color, the deep. But yeah, I'm just going to use this to contour. I contour my cheekbones and I also contour my chin. I don't know why. I just love the look of the snatch. I don't know if you'd call it a snatch chin, but I just like the way it looks when I contour my chin. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Sharpen up my contour. I'm going to use my Ben Nye powder in the color Topaz. I wouldn't use this for underneath my eyes because I'm not dark enough, but I feel like if you are darker than me, I don't want to say dark skin because I am dark skin, but if you are darker than me, then I'm pretty sure that you can use that as an under eye um, setting powder. And then I'm just going to go ahead and contour my nose a little bit because that concealer got up my nose and it just took away a lot of the color. Y'all, these are my favorite lashes. My Salon Pro lashes in the color, in the color, in the number 615. I got them from Walmart. They're so cute, so bomb, and then they're just so lightweight. Like, they're not too dramatic. So, I would recommend these for an everyday look. And then just to bring everything together and set my entire face, I'm going to use my Maybelline Fit Me powder in the color Coconut. Then I'm just going to put some mascara on my lashes just to make sure that there's no eyeshadow on them and to blend them in with my falsies. Now 
Now time for my favorite part, the highlight though. <laughs> I'm gonna use my AVH Glow Kit in the color Sun Dip. And then just to do my lips, I'm gonna use my favorite Revlon lip gloss. I'm not sure what color this is because the sticker wore off, so yeah. Last but not least, just highlight under them brows. Now I'm just gonna set my face with my Win and Wild setting spray. That's all for today's look. Thank you all for watching. Go ahead and comment, like, and subscribe, and all that good stuff. Add me on all social media. Hit me up. Let's be best friends, okay?